actually be seen. I'm not sexy. I do. I do. Yeah, no, I mean, to your point. It's 4.42. I really wasn't planning on vlogging today, but I figured why not. Seth and I hung out earlier. We went to the arcade, had fun. Now we are watching Home Alone. So just gonna chill out and watch this. That's all we've got going on this evening. Hope you all had a happy Thanksgiving. Thank you all for the sweet comments in my last vlog, well, my last two videos. Sorry y'all for the background noise. But anyway, um, I am going to go so that I can enjoy Home Alone with my son because he's never seen this movie before. So I asked him if he wanted to see it and he said yes. Yeah. So we're gonna enjoy that together. And yeah, that is gonna be it for us for the rest of the day and um yeah i will see you guys tomorrow all right hello everyone so it is the next day and i am going to make a chicken pot pie it's actually going to be like our lunch because it's just 12 30 <laughs> But I want to go ahead and get it made so that we'll have something to eat for lunch. And then if we want it for dinner, we can too. But I've been seeing all over the internet people making chicken pot pies. Now, I personally haven't had a pot pie since I was a kid. Um, my grandmother used to buy like the little frozen ones. But I do enjoy them, especially if they're done right. So that's what I'm going to make today. Um, I'm actually going to make mine kind of like a casserole. I know my girl, the chic nurse, Alicia she made some last week i think and she did them in like individual little rem remnants and it was so cute but i don't have any of those um i should probably put that on my list of things to get but i thought that was so cute and i wish i had some because i would do that but i'm just gonna do like a casserole style so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get started i was gonna do uh it's pj y'all I was gonna do a rotisserie chicken, but I've got chicken in the fridge that I need to cook anyway, so I'm gonna use that. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna make for us for today. And I thought I would share with you guys. Also, we are kicking off Vlogmas. I don't know if I mentioned it to you all, but I am going to do Vlogmas this year. I'm doing it the same way that I did it last year, 12 days of Vlogmas. I'll basically be vlogging every other day up until Christmas so yeah got lots of fun stuff planned I'm really excited especially with us being in a new city with new stuff um, so many of you guys have been sending me like little like festive things to do um, in the city so I've been making a list things that we're going to do with the kids things that I'm going to do just solo I'm going to try to do more venturing out um, and sharing things with you guys so yeah it should be fun you know vlog style is my preference when it comes to doing my YouTube videos anyway so it's really not going to be that different the only difference is is that it's just going to be more like festive christmas style things um, i'm excited for it seth's excited we've got our advent calendars um i showed you guys the, the nespresso advent calendar i also have a new candle advent calendar coming um i checked the shipping status it has been shipped so that should be coming sometime this week also got sefton two um advent calendars i'll show those to you guys and i got pj one too so yeah we're ready we're excited so many things that i want to share with you guys and do we're going to be doing some you know drinks and cocktails and all the things so yes we are doing vlogmas this year for sure 12 days 12 days of vlogmas for us here at happy stylish mommy yeah i'm gonna go start cooking and let you guys watch all right You know, real tradition. 
so good I didn't do celery because we didn't have any I only did peas and carrots I didn't do corn green beans but wow this is so good y'all all right y'all I'm in Target it is Cyber Monday it is bright and early they literally just opened and I'm just looking for more pajamas for Seth. All of the cat and jack ones are 30% off right now. So. Oh, this one's cute. Oh, I like that. I'm not getting one of these. Is that a size? Large. That's cute. Okay. Well, he's getting another one too. That's all I see. I know my mom is sending them pajamas too, so I don't want to go too crazy, but yeah, they also have the, um, the advent calendar socks. I thought about getting them another one of those, but we did that last year, so. so I am over here on PJ's side. This is okay. Oh, they have this one. Seth has one like this too from last year, actually. All right, y'all. It is a little bit later in the afternoon. I wanted to come back and share with you all what I picked up from Target. Um, also got a couple things that I got from Zara and I want to show you guys the advent calendars that I got for the boys. So first thing I want to share with you all is this coat y'all. It's by A New Day and it is just a super long puffer coat. It has like these little snaps on the end. It also, just try it on for you guys. I'll try to put up a photo so you guys can see it, but it has these little like bungee cords where you can like cinch the waistband. Makes the coat more flattering. It does run super, super big. They didn't have a medium, but I tried on a large and it like swallowed me. So I got a small and I love it. I love this color. It's coming up white or cream on camera, but it's like a dove gray. It's so nice, y'all. So yeah, I think, I think I'm good on coats. I really do. Like maybe one more, perhaps. But I just thought this was so nice. It was 60, I think. Hold on. This was the one thing that I got that was not on sale. Yeah, it was 60. I wanted to get another pair of the fleece line leggings that I get every year. Well, I've gotten every year for the past 
couple years, but they're so, so nice. So they didn't have the brand that I usually get, and I think I've shared it with you guys too. Um, they didn't have those in my size, but I saw that A New Day had a pair, so I thought I would give theirs a try. And I like that these are high-waisted, so I'm going to see how these work. But they're just black leggings, but they are lined with fleece to keep you warm which is what you need when you live somewhere like Chicago. The sizing chart on here says small, medium, four to 10, large, extra large, 12 to 16. Well, they didn't have small mediums, so I just got large, extra large. So these are probably gonna be a little big for me, but that's okay because these aren't really gonna be like my, like fashion leggings these are going to be more for like warmth and we are planning on doing some like outdoor festive stuff with the kids so i figured these would be great to wear with boots coat big sweaters and just cozy you know so i got those and then i got a pair of the assets Spanx shaping leggings i saw sharika b talking about these leggings and then as soon as i saw her talking about it I start seeing it everywhere and so I was like okay I need to try these leggings out so I picked up a pair and I got them in a size large so yeah we'll see how these go but they're supposed to be like bomb Sharika tried hers on and they looked amazing on her so yeah I'm excited to try these out and then I just picked up a new bra. I don't know about y'all, but I like Target bras. Like, I've always liked Target bras. They have really good bras for affordable price. So I got this one. Um, I, I'm actually wearing the same bra today in nude. I also have it in black. But I saw that it came in this green color. So I got it in green. And this was on sale. So the regular price was $25, and I got it for $12. So really good price for this it doesn't have any wire or anything it's just a really nice bra so i got that and i got seth another pair of slippers i thought that he would really like these they're kind of like a little you know puffy style uh slipper with a little like bow shearling inside something that i know he'll like he likes stuff like this and so I wanted to get him another pair of slippers. I just got these in a size medium for him. And then I showed you guys the onesie I got him, which is this like plaid one, which I thought was really nice. So I got that. And then from Amazon, you guys remember I mentioned, was in the last vlog or vlog before last, uh, I mentioned that I need to get a skull cap because I'm not someone that likes to wear hats, but I know I need them especially living here and so I found this one on Amazon and what's cool about this skull cap is that it is lined with satin so I don't have to worry about any like breakage or anything on my hair if you are looking for a skull cap with satin lining I will leave this one linked below they come in so many different colors I'm thinking about ordering maybe one more like a gray or maybe a cream just to have because I will be wearing hats often like once winter really hits here I'm gonna need a hat so I got this and also I thought this would be great too like on those days when I'm doing pick up and drop off at school I can leave my hair wrapped and just throw this on and my hair still be protected. So I love that about this. Also, if there, if there's a day that I want to go for a walk and it's really cold outside and I don't want to unwrap my hair, I can just throw my cap on. My head still be warm and my hair is still like wrapped up. So just wanted to share that with you guys. And I placed an order on Zara Home. I got these cute little glasses little trees on them so cute so i thought this would be cute to do like my iced coffees or regular coffees or whatever during vlogmas because yes there will be coffee of course i just thought those were so cute and they were four dollars and ninety cents each i got a new pair of slippers because I just love slippers it's funny because i almost got the ugg ones that look like this because i just like the way they look so much and i was browsing on the zara home site and saw these and i was like oh i like those oh i like the price too so here they are 
they have a hard bottom which is a nice it says zara home right there these were 49 and i just love the way they look like they literally look just like the ones that i've been seeing them advertise for ugg but for a fraction of the price of course so i got those as well i also got this little christmas tree little poppet for pj because he really likes playing with these so i saw this on zara and got that for him sefton loves bath bombs anytime we're in target anytime we're anywhere and they have bath bombs he wants one so i found him the coolest bath bomb advent calendar from a five below yes if you have kids and you're looking for like affordable advent calendars check five below i'll leave all these links below for you guys but i thought this was so cool and it's the elf on the shelf theme which we are elf on the shelf family so sam and peyton you guys will be seeing them throughout the house but yeah i just got this for him and it's only for a week so i don't know if he wants to do it like the week of christmas or throughout you know the month uh because he doesn't take a bath every day he showers every day but he doesn't like take a bath every day so i figured he could probably just use them like once a week when he takes a bath and then i got pj this really cool disney themed storybook advent calendar and it just has little short stories that you can read your baby every day until Christmas. And I just thought that was the cutest thing ever. It was also $5. Then I got Seth the Marvel one. Which he is going to love because he loves to read anyway. So my plan is to have him do this one in the evenings. And then he can read a book every night before he goes to bed really really cool little advent calendars that i got from five below so yeah i'm gonna leave all this stuff linked below that's going to do it for this vlog i am gonna go ahead and get this uploaded for you guys today today is monday and next time i see you guys it will be a vlogmas so i'm so excited it's gonna be good vibes and fun and festive stuff and just all the things so i will catch you guys later